to say goodbye to Rebecca, just tell us how has your service or being a volunteer, how has it changed your life as you get ready to fly back home? Oh. <laughs> changed immensely my outlook on on things my um, just the experience alone um, has made me think in a different mm -hmm. way oh. made me realize that um, as Americans you tend to have a sense of entitlement okay. um, and coming here that's wiped away and like uh, in working with the students and teachers here, there is no sense of entitlement from them, and it's refreshing, and it 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 changes your thought process and changes. It, it, I mean, it changes your life. I'm not going back the same Rebecca as I came, but I feel like I'm going back a better person and mm -hmm. a better version of myself. So there's naturally a readjusting there. Yes. You're readjusting. Yes, there's going to be a readjusting. Um, I'm not exactly sure what it's going it's to going feel to like. Um, yeah. I've talked to people that have already done it, and I know Curry has done it as well. Um, but I know, I mean, the first time I ever went home on, on a visit, I froze in the supermarket, and I had to, like, hide in a, like, away from the frozen foods. I was so cold because I had gotten used, not used to the heat, but you come, you become accustomed. Yeah, you become and so, yeah. yeah, so there are things like that that I know I'll have to get used to. But um, as for how difficult, I think the one thing I'm, I'm anticipating is, going there and for the first time not having a plane ticket back mm -hmm. and so knowing like I get there and it's I'm there okay so you may have to pinch yourself up you would have woken the first morning and realize I, I'm in a different territory yes 